Over the years, I had become fluent in the language Trump used to communicate his desires and demands. He used inferences, not silences, euphemisms, signals. It was similar to how Trump never used email for the simple reason that it created a digital fingerprint that would permanently record his words and thus potentially ensnare him. Like a crime boss, Trump wanted no evidence that could connect him to any of his deeds or deeds that he indirectly or directly ordered others to do. The same applied with conversations. If the president explicitly said what he wanted or needed, it could potentially be used against him. Better to say nothing that could be held against you, but surround yourself with people who can translate your intentions. Trump's mind was so permeated with deception and delusion of others, but also of himself that I had to be prepared to literally depart from reality and enter a kind of fantasy land when I spoke with the president.